Hey you guys, it is Wanny back on your screen bringing you a brand new video here on More Wanny and today we are joined with more Lincoln, Lincoln, woo! We got more Lincoln back on your screen as well. If you guys are new here, make sure you guys smash the subscribe button down below so you never miss one of our brand new videos. And today we are going to be reviewing and checking out the best school bus driving game in all of Roblox. What do you think, Lincoln? I am so excited for this game. All right. Well, let's go check out Lincoln's bus. Woo! Bus 852 is bus right over here. Everybody come on board. Bus come on, 852. Come on board. Lincoln's bus here. We're going to see. What do you think of this bus, Lincoln? So this bus is the 2013 model year, so it's a little bit older, but it starts right up. Starts right up. You give know, it give it a moment give it a moment it, it takes some time here it takes and, some time but yeah i mean it's got the nice hazards here and it's got plenty of space here for everybody to come in so honestly it's got great attention to detail this detail. is like a real school bus if you guys ever been on a bus in real life it usually has this showing which bulbs are illuminated right. on the outside of the school bus it's got these i don't know what would you call these lincoln emergency exits it's got the emergency exit it's, it's got, got two of those you can open and close them it's got the rear door and this emergency button you can press to turn off the alarm you can also put this little sign up if your bus is empty or if you are picking up students also got this side emergency exit as well <laughs> I mean this is just super super realistic so let's take a look at the exterior here I mean this is super nice and super realistic what do you think Lincoln it is really good bus it's got all the flashers and uh, everything you can open up the vents here. Maybe you can even open up the driver window. Uh, <laughs> guys, could you imagine if Lincoln was your school bus driver? Imagine this pulling up to your house. What would you guys think? Uh, I would tell people to sit down. <laughs> sit down. All right. Well, this is the 2013 bus. I got the 2020 Ooh. school bus. A little bit more modern than Lincoln's, I would have to say. Pretty nice, if you ask me. I really like these rear LED lights compared to Lincoln's got those halogen bulbs over here. Let's head inside my bus right now. We got a great dashboard over here. We're going to start it up. We're going to start it up. As you guys can see, the gauges have a nice gauge sweep over here. Super realistic. You have to wait until it is ready to start. It takes a moment. It says like waiting to start. All right, there we go. Bus to start. When you turn on the turn signal, mine has the bus illumination over here for the bus driver to see. I mean, it is super, super nice. And as you can see, we got a great interior here on this school bus. It's also got the emergency exit. It also has the rear door that you can exit out of as well. And it's got the vents on the roof. So super, super realistic. And also makes that noise when you are putting it in reverse. So we're going to get on the road right now. And we are going to close our power door over here. And we are going to go check out this game, you guys. I am super excited. Seriously, this game is absolutely insane. A great game to play if you want to role play as a bus driver. I mean, there is so much to do. Now, if you want to pick up passengers, you have to turn on the switch over here until it is green. And that means when you pull up in the neighborhood, you will be picking up passengers to get on your school bus. So here's the neighborhood right over here. We'll be doing a little bit of a stop here to pick up students to go to school. And guys, it is just super realistic and super cool. So we're going to stop here in the neighborhood. We're going to turn on our flashing lights, as you can see down there and on the outside of the bus. That means the bus is coming to a stop and you're just going to open up your flashing signs after you open up your door. So let's open up our door here and we are going to get some passengers aboard our bus. Now our stop signs should go out. I hope they should go out, guys. I don't know what's going on. My stop signs are not working. Hold on, let's see what's going on here. All right. Lincoln, you having trouble back there? I must have not. Uh, sometimes the lights do work, sometimes the bus stop sign doesn't. Yeah, sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. So let's try this again. All right, we have the lights on, and it should work when you press B to open up the stop yeah, signs I mean, here. The, the people will come and they'll go. But I think it's just like, try, yeah, V is the warning. Oh, there we go, there, there we, we go. go. Takes the call presses and the students will enter the All right, bus. you guys, students should be entering the bus. Hopefully there's some students in this area. I'm not seeing anybody getting Did on the bus right now. Did you just have to press now. B again waiting for it? Or yeah, what? just had to press B again. And as you can see, the stop signs close after you close your door. So let's keep moving on the road one more time here. I don't know, the bus is having some sort of malfunction here today, you guys. All right, we're gonna have to restart the bus here. Seriously, 
All right, well, I do not think that there's going to be any students getting on the bus. As you can see at the top of the screen there, it says we are on a break, which means that you just get to drive around the town and explore, which is super, super cool. So let's get back on the road right now, and we will test out these features again later on when we are not on our break. So as you can see, super realistic neighborhood here. Unfortunately, you could not go in any of these houses, but I mean, it is actually really cool when the students do get on your bus. All right, I think something's beeping on my boss. You have to stop the boss and you have to go press this button on the back. I don't know why this happens, but it does happen. So you press that button and it will stop beeping. It's just like some sort of safety alarm in case uh, you leave any students in the bus. You gotta walk all the way to the back to make sure your bus is empty. So we're gonna get back on the road, guys. This is actually so realistic. I love how realistic these roads are. You could actually drive in first person, which I really like as well. You can see the turn signals on the dashboard, which are super, super cool. And you could even turn around and see the people on your school bus. So we are rolling down the road right now. As you guys can see, this game has amazing, amazing views. And it is actually so realistic. You can yeah. see there's mountains. There's actually a highway you could go on as well. I mean, I just really, really like this a lot. What are your thoughts, Lincoln? Well, the bus definitely needs a, you know, steering. You do not want to take a turn fast in the bus. Yeah, you do not want to go too fast on the bus because your brakes do not work that good since you're driving such a huge vehicle. But guys, remember, when you are going across a railroad track, you need to stop the bus and you need to open up your door and listen for any trains that might be coming across the track so we're going to open our door here we are going to turn on our flashing lights and our stop sign letting people know that we need to have people stop so that we can listen and you can put on the hazards you can always put on the hazards all right there are no trains coming so we're going to close our door and we are going to keep on driving there we go everybody there we go as you can see this game is absolutely amazing it's super realistic and sometimes it does glitch with the controls but i think that is something that they are working on to get fixed and repaired but other than that i mean i really do enjoy it so we're gonna hopefully get on the highway here so we can check out some of those highway views but guys i'm hoping that our break is over here pretty soon so that we can pick up more passengers we're gonna try one more time over here and see, see if my bus is fast Lincoln like wants to race the buses honestly all right we're gonna open up our doors here and we are going to see um, if any students get on the bus we're gonna open up our signs over here and we're gonna see if any students get on the bus all right guys you gotta be patient unfortunately I think it's not gonna work because we're on break it says up here but Lincoln and I tried it out before the video and students actually get on the bus there's NPCs like the ones in Greenville that come to the restaurants they'll just get on your bus all right, Lincoln, let's keep driving here, and we are going to hopefully get on the highway here soon, and we are going to check out the rest of this game. As you can see, Lincoln still needs some practice driving his school bus. It, takes some time, everybody. it does take some time, everybody. It does take some time. It's all these sounds. It's like, uh, you know, all, all these sounds. I know. The bus is super realistic. It makes a bunch of noise as well when you're hitting the brakes. You can hear the squeaking brakes. But you do have to take some very wide turns when you're driving a bus, you guys. It does take a lot of practice, and, you know, I'm still not used to it myself. But it is super realistic. We're going to hopefully find the highway here and show you guys a little bit more of the game. As you can see, it is very difficult to maneuver these buses. They are gigantic. Let me tell you, this is the biggest vehicle I've ever driven in my life. So we're going to take a left turn over here and we're going to go where we came from. And hopefully we are going to find the main entrance to the highway so that we can show you guys a little bit more of this game because there is definitely a lot to see you guys. Oh, yeah. I really just love the realism of this game. I feel like I'm an actual bus driver right now, don't you Lincoln? Yeah, my bus is like breaking down oh gosh lincoln's bus is like breaking down my speedometer actually works which is super super cool i've never seen that in like any game you guys working speedometer we are getting on the highway right now and we are going to go explore the town Ho and you can just like see yourself doing field trip role plays with your friends in this game yeah i could see myself doing a lot of fun things you know being a bus driver going on a field trip taking students to and from where they need to go. I mean, there is just so much to do, you guys. I just cannot believe it. All right, of course, we're like getting stuck here. It is yeah. so difficult to drive on these ramps, you guys. I know, my bus, I couldn't even take the turn to get on the Lincoln ramp. cannot even get on the ramp. I don't know, Try guys. Me on the camera. We're trying to do our best. Lincoln's all the way back there. 
So we are getting on the highway right now. Luckily, I'm a little bit of a better bus driver than Lincoln. Why do they drive so fast, everybody. I always leave Lincoln in the dust, you guys. We are going so fast, and we want to go check out the highway. Looks like they're doing some road construction oh, over here. That, that is so cool. cool. That is actually really cool. But guys, we're getting on the highway right now, and we don't know where this takes us, but we can see the entire city as we are driving on the freeway. Hopefully, Lincoln will be able to catch up to us later on. But guys, I'm having so much fun. This is definitely a great game that you guys should check out. There is so much to do, so much to see here, and there is a lot to explore. There's also a place that you can go ride go-karts, which is located on the other side of town. Maybe we will find that when we get off of this highway. I mean, guys, look at these views uh, from up yeah. here. There is the... Oh, I thought that was a St. Louis arch, but it's literally just my mirrors over there. That's okay, that's okay. I thought it was like a huge arch over landmarks. there. Huge landmarks everywhere, but as you guys can see, this game is so... Cool. I definitely recommend it. I will leave it linked in the description so you guys can test it out yourself and let me know your thoughts down below in the comment section. So we're going to be getting off the highway right now and actually I think the go-kart place is somewhere over here. I think we got to take a left turn and I think it is right down over here you guys. So hopefully I could show you that before the end of the video because it is just super cool. You could also take the students on a field trip to go go-karting. I mean, there's just so much to do. As you can see, they have a lot of buildings that you cannot go in, but I mean, it's still a great place to see. All right, guys, I think we're pulling up to the go-kart place right now. I'm gonna go in this do not enter sign over here. Sorry, sorry, everybody, we're pulling up here. Or actually, this might be a stadium. Guys, they added this stadium. I think this used to be where the go-kart place was, but guys, look at how cool this is. Imagine taking the students here on a huge football game field trip. I think that would definitely oh, yeah. be a great Man, trip. Look at this, cool. Lincoln. Look at this. It's insane. Seriously, it is super, super nice. As you can see, they have a huge stadium here. And I'm sure when it's nighttime, the lights actually go oh, on. Yeah. So it is super realistic. And there is a go-kart place somewhere in the town. Let's see if we can see it. I think they actually moved it. Oh, Let's yeah. see. I'm not seeing it. There's a museum over there. I mean, there's a lot to do in this game, you guys. So you definitely need to check it out. It is seriously so amazing, so realistic as well. I mean, I've never seen such a great bus driving game as this one is. I mean, could you imagine going with a bunch of buses on a field trip, you know, role playing, driving, I think it'd be so great. But guys, now it is the PM route. So we are going to go pick up some students right now. Just gotta wait for the bus to be ready to go. Here we go, she's all started up and she is ready to go. You can also turn on and off these interior lights. I like to drive with mine on. Seriously, super nice, oh gosh. Now we gotta press that button in the back of the bus, you guys. As you can hear, the bus is making a noise. You gotta press that button in the back for the noise to stop. I mean, seriously guys, this is a great, great game and I honestly think you guys should check it out. Lincoln, what would you rate this game out of 10? I would say seven because my bus Sometimes work. <laughs> Lincoln would give it a seven. You know, it does glitch sometimes where the controls do not work all the time, but honestly, I think I would give it a solid eight out of 10. I really have a lot of fun with this game. Seriously, it is so much fun. Let's see if we can pick up some passengers over here. I'm gonna turn on my emergency lights, letting people know that I'm stopping. And we are going to put out our stop signs and open up our door. Let's see guys, let's see. Hopefully we'll get some passengers, or maybe, I bet we have to go to the school to pick up the students. Yeah, we probably have to go to the school to pick up the students because in the AM, you pick them up at their house, and then the PM, you pick them up at the school, you guys. So we're gonna try and find the school, but guys, look at how realistic this is. I've been having a blast checking out this game with Lincoln. Oh, yeah. Lincoln, what did you give it out of 10? Seven. Give it a seven. I would give it a solid eight out of 10. It is just super fun. I love the first person point of view. If this game did not have the first person point of view, not sure that it would be my favorite, but honestly, since it has this, I think it gives it that extra bump of being a great game. Definitely has a lot of potential for role plays, for hanging out with friends, and you know, just having a lot of fun with everybody. As you can see, these intersections are so detailed. I'm not sure that the stoplights actually work because every time I sit there, they just stay red, you guys. So I don't think those actually do anything. I think they're just for decoration. There's even a car wash over here, which is super, super cool. Don't think they wash 
buses, but you know, maybe one day they will. So as you guys can see, this game is absolutely insane. Highly recommend it for you guys to test it out. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. Are you guys going to try out this bus game? Because I know that you guys do love bus games just as much as me. So guys, go check it out. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. And thank you guys so much for tuning in to today's More Wanny video. We appreciate your support oh, yeah. so much. And we look forward to seeing you guys in the next video. Thanks so much for watching, everybody. And we will see you in the next one. Bye, everybody. Woo!